Hello everyone, what's up? It's me, Micah, and welcome to another Life and Favorites video. If you guys are new to my channel, hello, welcome to this channel. You are very much appreciated here. For those of you who have been with me for quite some time now, welcome back, my loves. So basically what I do for my favorites videos is that I don't only share my favorite things of the month, but I also share my new learnings that I've picked up. If you guys have seen my past video, then you know that this episode is going to be a major, major life update. We're gonna get right into that, but before anything, of course, lippy of the day. I am wearing something new actually on my lips. So this is from the brand called Rare Beauty by Selena Gomez, and it is in the shade Thankful. So this is a dewy lip. It's kind of like a lip balm. It feels very, very light on the lips. It's quite glossy, but not tacky at all. I love this. If only I can get another one, but thanks to Nina. Thank you, Ninong Bambi, for sending me some rare beauty products from the States. Before we hop right into the video, this episode of my Life and Favorite series is sponsored by Skillshare. You all know that I love to learn new skills or hone the ones that I already have. Skillshare has been a really great platform in keeping me inspired to get better at my craft since they have a wide variety of classes to choose from. I've saved three classes so far. The first two classes are under film and video because you guys know that I make YouTube videos for a living and I want to develop my skill not just in making content but also editing as well. And then the last class that I took is under creative writing because I've also been meaning to get better at fluidly relaying my thoughts and at the same time being responsible with how I share them online. And to go to your running thoughts is Micah, how much will that cost? You guys don't even have to worry about that because it's very very affordable. A year subscription will only cost you less than $10 or less than 500 pesos in a month. For just that much, you get to develop your skills, learn new skills, and grow at the same time and that to me is priceless. For those of you who are very interested and you want to try out the subscription first, you gotta be fast because this link will only be available to the first 1,000 people who will use it. Alright guys, let's head right into my first life favorite. So guys, last November 8, Adrian and I got engaged, which is pretty insane. Like I, mm. I'll talk to you guys about all the details, like the dress, the wedding date, and everything engagement related in a different video, hopefully with Adrian on my side. But for today, I really do want to emphasize on two points. Prior to the engagement, there were a lot of things that I thought were highly important leading up to that moment. One of them being the ring and then the second one being how Adrian will propose to me. It turns out that when you're there at that moment, all those elements will really lose their luster. They won't seem as shiny as how society deems them to be and I personally believe that that is the attitude that we're all supposed to have about it. I think it's about time that we didn't put as much value to the ring and how grand the engagement is or how grand the wedding will be. Because yes, all those may play a role in getting to the goal, but it's not the essence. It's not the end all and the be all of the proposal. In my opinion, it would be very shallow of me and even Adrian if we put all of our energy, our efforts, and our money in those elements because all of those will just pass away eventually. I want to put an end to over glorifying shallow things because I want people to start dreaming deeper. You know, in the past, whenever people would ask me to dream big, I would think, okay, I'll dream big. I'll have the best career and I will have this really big house and this super nice car and that was dreaming big for me. So now since we're on the topic of, you know, wedding, engagement, proposal and all that, think of your dream proposal or your dream wedding and why you consider it your dream. 
what makes it big? Our answer to that will determine whether we're leaning towards a more shallow or a deeper reason. I'm not gonna get so much into that because I also wanna give you time to ponder on that question. But in addition, another thing that Adrian and I keep double checking on our Excel file is really not to splurge on the wedding so much, but to invest in our marriage. The whole purpose of getting engaged in the first place is not to get to a celebration, which is just the wedding, but to be married. Don't get me wrong, if you have extra extra to make your wedding as big as possible then by all means go ahead and do that at the same time throughout the few weeks that adrian and i have been prepping and have been planning our wedding we believe that it's very important not to lose sight of why you're entering a marriage in the midst of the glitz and glam of the prep season now we are gonna head on to my favorite things for the month of November. Starting out with something bridal related, I'm gonna spill a secret. I already have a wedding gown. Yes guys, you heard that right. I already have a wedding gown, but our wedding is not until five months from now. Actually just four months thinking about it. Siguro nagtataka ako bakit parang ang bilis ko naman na meron na agad akong wedding gown. First of all, I'm a very decisive bride to be. When I want something, I'm going to get it and I want to stop looking. Kasi ayoko rin yung sobrang dami kong options tapos parang hilong-hilo na ako na ano ba yung gusto kong kunin. I don't want to go through that stress and I really want to enjoy the prep stage. And I feel like in order for you to enjoy it, you have to be decisive. Secondly, I'm really made for ready to wear dresses. I don't think I'm patient enough to wait like three months to see what my wedding gown is going to look like because what if it's a disaster? So like I'd rather see what it looks like and be able to try it on and say yes to the dress right off the bat. And that is why I got my gown from this Instagram shop called Arcasa Morales. I'm gonna link their Instagram handle down below. Basically Arcasa Morales was actually my first choice because it was recommended to me by my sister and then one of my friends. Then of course, I naghanap ako na naghanap ng naghanap ng naghanap nagtanong ng nag-inquire pero lahat sila mga 30,000 pesos and above and I'm like am I really willing to spend that much money on a gown that may be super duper important probably the most important gown I'll ever wear in my life but I'm also only gonna wear once and I was also very certain that the wedding business is a very 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 big and a broad business meron ako mahahanap na perfect for a lower price and the quality that I want so I went all the way back to my first choice which was Arcasa Morales I sent them a message and asked for fitting details and then boom they're like okay you just have to pay five you get to try three dresses and guys yung mga dresses nila meron sila mga for sale pero most of them are for rental and they go from five thousand pesos you're probably like Micah did you say rental you're gonna rent your gown yeah why not but also i did not rent my gown i found a gown that was for sale and i bought it from arcasa morales it is no longer on her website which i'm also gonna link down below so you guys will not see it until my wedding day but she has so many many choices and guys the owner of arcasa morales is the nicest person as in it's like she's an angel i'm not even kidding you so if you guys simply want to inquire ask about a certain dress or just simply browse on their website you can definitely do so and she will answer all of your questions as in mabilisan and with much love so i just want to say thank you thank you to miss Ital for being the kindest and the easiest to work with i'm so happy i am over the moon that i bought my dress from you guys as in ang ganda ng dress ko as in para siyang 100,000 pesos ganun yung, ganun yung feeling ko thank you miss Ital. that's all i can say to my favorite devices of the month starting off with something I've already featured on my channel we have here the Studio Smooth IPL hair removal device grabe talaga kung gaano ka convenient yung magkaroon ng sariling hair removal device at home nagagamit ko siya sa legs ko sa arms ko sa upper lip ko everywhere under arms ko and sobrang effective niya talaga it's painless and I even use it on the upper part of the intimate area 
if you know what I mean. So I highly recommend this if you're thinking of saving in the long run, if you also want convenience, and at the same time, you want to keep safe during this pandemic. The next device that is on my list is perfect for anyone and everyone. I have here my steamer. Oh, diba? Nakalagay pa siya sa parang case. Yes, it came with a case. This is from the brand Dirma, and the reason why I bumili ulit ako from the brand Dirma is because sobra sobrang love ko yung wireless vacuum ko from them. And then I decided nga to get a steamer para din sa mga fashion related videos ko. Hindi na puro gusot gusot yung mga dresses ko. It's actually like a gun. Flip it like that. And then yun na yun. Magsisteam ko na. Ipapress mo lang tong button na to. And of course, isasaksak mo siya. You can also attach this little brush siguro para mas mild yung mag-steam mo if ever. Or parang mas mabigyan ka ng direction. A dress you can do under 5 minutes or within 5 minutes. Unlike pag nag-iron ka, parang magugusot lang siya na magugusot because you keep tumbling it around. Or maybe I'm just really not the type to iron my clothes because I'm not good at it. That's why. Steamer is life, guys. I promise, it's really good. Of course, guys, hindi mo wawala yung skincare on every favorite video. I feel like there is a skincare portion because I love, I just love rotating my skincare regimens. And there are some that I keep naman. But as much as possible, I really like exploring. I like exploring skincare to find the best one. So far, these two have retained for quite some time now. I just love this. This is the Derm Action Plus by Watson's The Cleansing Water. This is the anti-acne variant. Grabe kasi yung naging acne production ko ever since I started wearing masks outside all the time. And this has really been good at helping me tame that down. I use this as my toner, but I also use it to remove my makeup at times. It's very, very gentle. It's almost just like putting water on your face. It is just water because it's cleansing water. Another one from Watson's is this Germ Action Plus na Solar Barrier. I use this more for my face because first time ko maka-encounter ng sunscreen na sobrang light na pagkatapos mong ilagay sa mukha mo, masisip siya immediately ng skin mo. And you won't even feel the stickiness or the achiness and it's also not gonna leave a white cast on your face. Okay, sobrang gamit na gamit ko siya na nasira ko na po yung takip. I highly recommend this guys and as well as the cleansing water. Basta lahat naman ng papakita ko sa inyo sa video na to will be listed in the description box below. And last but not the least, we have this Elana Even Skin. It's a pore refining, lightweight cleansing oil. This is so good at removing makeup. I really, really like this because it has jojoba oil and other really good skincare ingredients. That's what I love about cleansing oils. It's also very environmentally friendly since you won't have to use cotton pads in order to get rid of your makeup. Again, the link to this will be in the description box below. Alright guys, that is it for this video. I hope that you all enjoyed it. If you have any wedding related questions for me, please comment that in the comment section. I would love to hear what your questions are and syempre, discuss with Adrian how we can address them better. If you also have any questions about the products that I showed you or my life favorite for this month, then go ahead and ask them in the comments section as well. I'm leaving you guys with love, hope, and faith. For today, you watched me, Michael Louise, and I cannot wait to see you again. Bye, everyone. Thank you.